Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome back to. Um, I think that's going too fast. There we go. Welcome back to Men of War Assault Squad 2. In the last battle, we had uh, basically Germans trying to defend a depot, but they lost pretty badly, actually. And because of that, they lost fuel and all sorts of stuff, so they do not have as many tanks, they do not have as many men. And the Russians, on the other hand, are not doing so well neither. Even though they did take out the depot, they failed to kill the general, so the general got a lot more uh, strategies, I guess you could say. And more uh, artilleries and yada yada onto the battlefield of this battle that is about to commence. Beyond that hill, straight ahead of us, on the camera you see right now, is a beautiful town. And the Russians, this is their first line in the border between Poland and Russia. The Germans poised to break through this line. The uh, Russians are going to try their best to defend it. I'm not exactly sure who will win this battle, in all honesty. The Germans, because they have less tanks and less men, or the Russians, because they're spread very thin. I'm not exactly sure any line can break, but we'll find out. I think I'm going to start here and work my way down. This is a full map battle, so it's going to lag like crazy in the beginning, but oh well. If you enjoy this video, please do leave a like. It means a lot to me. And without, uh, uh, without anything else to say, let's get started. Okay, so the Germans are now coming out of the field and the tanks are now moving up. That is a lot of tanks. Both sides are opening fire. The Germans are coming out of the line with their tanks. They're getting a lot of explosions. I am down to nine frames right now. I don't know if it's YouTube is going to try to fix this and maybe make it a little bit faster for you guys. But I am down to nine frames. Ten frames. No, I went up a little bit. The battle is still commencing. Both sides are taking heavy casualties, it looks like. There we go. Okay, now I'm back up to 19 frames. Both sides are taking pretty heavily. Let's go back to the middle and see how they're doing. I don't see... Okay, I see a couple German tanks. Let's go to this side. This side is chaotic. But the Germans have broken through, it looks like. Or, or trying to. Oh my goodness, this tank is coming online. Oh, jeez. It almost came at those cannons. That was close. Some... Russian with an RP, the bazooka or something destroyed that RPG. <laughs> Germans are still pushing through. Uh, doesn't look so good for the Russians. Both sides look like they've taken heavy casualties. I'm not seeing many Germans. I think they're hiding in the tree line. Judging by all that movement. Germans are now pushing through. Spotted them. Ah! Oh. Those artilleries are going to be the last draw when it comes down to this. Looks like the Germans have actually pushed through, even with their weaknesses. And I, I blame their superior armor. Look at that, 10 to 80. That is ridiculous compared to like uh, T34 version one, which is 2052. Aye, aye, aye. Still see a Russian tank over here firing. He's just running back and he's still. Inside the explosions. Oh! This is the artillery um, shooting up again. All sides are taking a bit of uh, explosions. Oh, there's a huge gunfight now going on. Germans are trying to push up now. Russians are trying to hold. I hear a tank. Oh, no, that's a Russian tank. Oh, that hull got pierced. 
Andrew's trying to abandon it. Get out, get out, get out. Get out, get out, run! Oh my goodness, Stalin has not put the... Not one step back yet, so... Ay, ay, ay. Germans are now pushing up. Falling back. Looks like the Germans have taken the left flank. They're trying to take the middle now. Yeah, the right and uh, middle are still holding strong, but the Germans are pushing through. up there, but it stops. I don't know what the Russians are gonna do. They're still holding, though. They're holding pretty well. Amazingly, they're actually holding off the, um, Germans. Kind of. Both sides have taken heavy casualties. Uh, in all honesty, there's only like one German tank still remaining. That's what I see. Uh, there goes the artillery. The artillery's still shooting up. Oh, wow, look at that. There's four uh, panzers over there. One's super armored, yellow one's regular. Ouch. Oh, that looks like the crew just uh, completely abandoned that uh, field gun. I don't know, guys. I think it's over. Oh my goodness! That one battle there, or that one uh, turn over there is giving his last. Oh! That was a pa uh oh. This tank's in trouble. Oh, but it's bouncing off. Turns turning. Shoot it again. Shoot it again. Shoot it again. Uh, maybe they ran out of ammo. Like. Oh, the Germans are actually taking a lot of damage over here. Oh my goodness! They're in the they're in the the bushes with bazookas and stuff, and they're just taking out the tanks. They may pull this around. I see a lot of Russians kind of retreating. I I don't exactly see them because they're hiding in the bushes, but this is a scary battle. Wow, okay. Let's just look at the battlefield for a sec here. I will put myself on the German team. Oh yeah, they still got some. They still got some. They, like, they may be able to do it. I don't know, though. Okay, I'm gonna put myself on the German team. And boom! So we see we, oh my goodness, look at the German casualties on their line. Compared, actually the, uh, the Germans look like they took more damage than the Russians. Wow. Yeah, they're pushing up the hill now. Russians are falling back or trying to. Oh no. Oh, 
Go back to the house. Go back to the house. Russians are retreating now. Like, I still got a bazooka, so they still have somewhat of an anti-tank. They're gonna run th for this house now, to see here. if they can try to defend it. Try to defend it the best way you can, guys. Germans are now moving up, up onto the house. Fire shot! Oh, that guy got wiped. <laughs> look, look at this Russian guy. He's like, these two Russian guys are just crawling, hoping not to be found. Uh oh. Aww. Run, you fool! Run! Ah! Ay, ay, ay! Ay, ay, ay! Germans are running into that building! The Russians are. Oh, they're trying to. Is there a car in there? <laughs> Drive out. Uh, I'm gonna admit they did try. I'm just gonna admit they did try. The Germans are just unloading the house. Fire shots. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, he took out one! Oh, no, he lost one! These guys up top! They're shooting down below! They seem to be pretty well armored. Germans are falling back now. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm gonna see how long they last. Germans thinking about moving in. He moved in! Oh my goodness, they wiped out two guys. These three guys are holding off so well. Oh no. Oh. You know, it's kind of sad. I honestly thought they were going to do it. Like, I mean, they're outnumbered, but they kind of like... Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, there goes one guy. Okay, let me look at the, like, I can't get any closer. Yeah, I should... If I, I'm gonna be the Germans, and I don't want this whole massacre to happen again, so... Fall back. Fall back, the Germ... Oh, did they get him? They got him! Oh. Well, that's the end of that. Looks like the German tanks are now moving into the village. So are the infantry. So, I guess that's the end of this battle. Look at that. There's still some fighting. I think they're just shooting at bodies at this point. It was a good fight. It was a good fight. The Russians put up a pretty good fight. Germans did break through, even though I deleted like 10 Russian, uh, German tanks. Oh well. Damn. I guess we'll have the evasion of the village up next. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please do leave a like. It means a lot to me. And thank you for watching.